What's up everybody? Welcome back to Team Fish Knuckles YouTube channel. Today is Expanded Thursday and as you see PTCGO has been updated with Ancient Origins which means we can test out one of the most hype decks of times of the time right now and that is Shiftry. Now Shiftry has the ability Giant Fan. When you place Pokemon from your hand to evolve one of your Pokemon you may flip a coin. If heads, choose one of your opponent's Pokemon. Your opponent shuffles that Pokemon and all cards attached to it into his or her deck and that's all we're going to do here. We're not even going to attack. We're just going to use Giant Fan and try to shuffle all your opponent's Pokemon into the deck and win the game. And you can potentially do this turn one before your turn. Your opponent even has a turn. And that is, uh, it's really scary, but really good at the same time here. Now, to help out Shiftry, we have three Shaman, which has the ability set up. You put Shaman down, you draw, you have six cards in your hand. And basically, what you want to try to do with this deck is draw... You just want to basically deck yourself out, and if you could do that, you probably flipped enough heads to shuffle in all your opponent's Pokemon in turn one. Now, you do play four Unknown, which is kind of like the Unknown art that we had back in 2010, 29, 2009, whatever year it was. Um, once during your turn, before you attack, if this Pokemon is on your bench, you may discard this Pokemon and all cards attached to it. If you do, draw a card. Now, remember, Unknown has to be on the bench, and that is a key thing to note here. The only thing I wish about Unknown is I wish it would be called Unknown R just like it was back in the day. So that way we can have more unknowns in the game like Unknown Q and all this stuff. But as for right now, we just have this one unknown and nothing else. And that's all the Pokemon in here. Now let's go over the trainers. There is a lot in here. We play four Acrobike. Look at the top cards. You two, look at the top two cards you deck. Put one of them in your hand. Discard the other card. One Battle Compressor, shush deck up to three cards and discard them. Now with this, you're going to discard it, force the giant plants once you get one out. Once you get one out, you don't need any more. You're going to discard the other three and maybe some other useless cards. Maybe the level balls because you already got the Nuzleaves or... I don't know, I think the only card you really want to discard with Battle Compressor is Force of Giant Plants, and if you already played a Juniper, discard a Juniper. We play four Bicycle, draw cards, you have four cards in your hand. You are going to play your hand down fairly quickly. Four Devolution Sprays, you de-evolve one of your evolved Pokemon and put the highest stage Pokemon into your hand. So basically, you pick up a Shiftry into your hand, and that way you can reuse it later. We have four level ball, uh, search deck for a Pokemon with 90 HP or less, and if you if you don't know this, C dot, uh, Nuzleaf, and Unknown all have 90 HP or less. Shifter has 130, and Shaman has 110. We play four recycle, flip a coin of heads, put a card from your discard ball onto the top of your deck, and of course you want to put Devolution Spray back on top of your deck so that way you can reuse it the following turn. Or maybe Super Scoop Up, or but most part you want to put Devolution Spray. If you can recycle all your Devolution Sprays back onto your deck, you have eight tries automatically to Giant Fan Pokemon if you don't have any priced. Once Scoop Up Cyclone, and this is to pick up maybe Shaman, to pick up Shift Trees. Most part you're picking up Shift Trees so you can put down the whole line again to reuse it. Or Super Scoop Up, so that way you can try to pick Shift Trees back up. If you flip a coin, if heads, pick up Shift Tree and everything. So you pick up the C Dot, Nuzleaf, and Shift Tree. And then you can put it straight back down. And I'll explain that here in a second. For Trainer's Mail, look at the top four cards of your deck. Pick a Trainer card except for Trainer's Mail, put it in your hand. And of course, this is to help you get Forest of Giant Plants turn one. If you can do that, you can start uh, uh, Giant Fan your Pokemon away pretty quickly. For Ultra Ball, search deck for uh, discard two cards in your hand, search deck for any Pokemon card, and of course this is going to get you Shift Trees. Maybe if you don't have Nuz uh, Nuzleaf or Seedots, you can search for that too. Two Juniper, you could play AZ, but Juniper seems better, so that way you can draw through your deck quicker. Four Forest of Giants Plants. Now this is why this whole deck works here. Each player grass Pokemon can evolve during his or her turn. Uh, their turn they put down that Pokemon. So when you put down a C dot, you can automatically evolve into Nuzleaf, which can automatically evolve into Shiftry. Even though Shiftry is not a grass Pokemon, the ruling states that each player's grass Pokemon can evolve, so you can evolve Nuzleaf into Shiftry. Pretty nice there. Um, and this is why it's kind of broken. If it said that you can evolve one of your grass Pokemon into a grass Pokemon, It'd be totally different, but since you can just evolve your grass Pokemon, you can evolve Nuzleaf into Shiftry, and that's why this whole deck works. We play one Floatstone so that way you can put in the unknown. And like I said earlier, if no unknown is not in your bench, you can't, I mean, if it's in your Axe Pod, you actually can't use it. So you need a Floatstone to put on the unknown, retreat it, and then use Fairward Letter to actually discard it. And that's the deck here. It's pretty straightforward. You're going to try to Giant Fan as, oft as often as you like and as quickly as you like, and if you can flip, 
six heads, you can potentially shuffle in all your opponent's Pokemon into the deck. Now, this list is actually Andrew Wombots from the Charizard Lounge. He actually tested this some, and if you want to read more about this deck and everything about it, I'll leave the article down below. Big shout out for, to him for actually doing this, and he leaves a lot of statistics with it, but we're actually going to show the deck in action, so I hope you enjoy this deck and let's see it in action here. Alright, so we're playing against Keldeo Dash, who's playing a Fighting fire lightning psychic and we do get to go first here so let's see if we can potentially shuffle in all my opponent's pokemon into the deck we'll put down c dots and uh, let's start the party here let's see what we get here we'll keep the shamans in our hand of course and let's see what a uh, two hall luchas and a fanfy all right so let's start the party what we'll acrobike oh we'll grab a grab a nuzleaf we're just digging for a forest of giant plants here with we'll acrobike Oh, we got the Forest of Giant Plants. There we go. So put down the Forest of Giants plant. Put down a Nuzleaf. Play a Shaman. Draw into have six cards in her hand. We get Acrobike. Search for C dot. Put that down. Put down the Nuzleaf. Here we can Shaman. Draw to have six cards in her hand. We can play a Battle Compressor. And uh, here we can discard the other Force of Giants plants. They're not very useful in this matchup right now, or anymore, because we already have the one out. So we discard one, two. All right, so just those two. Here we'll play a. Re do we play a recycle to get back a trainer's mill? Let's do that. Let's play a recycle heads. So we can put back a trainer's mill. Okay, we'll do that. Here we'll play a bicycle. We know we get the trainer's mill. We'll play it. Here we get a level ball. We can play the level ball to get out another C dot. Now let's get an unknown, and then we can put it down. We can play the bicycle to draw four cards. Here we get another unknown. We get a trainer's mill. Uh, I'm not gonna grab anything. And here I'm just gonna scoop up Cyclone to Shaman, and we're gonna put it back down. Use it. Man, we have yet to hit a, 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 a shifter here. We'll play Pharaoh Letter, Pharaoh Letter, put down another unknown, play it again. Uh, Super Scoop Up, trying to pick up a Shaman, tells, uh, play the unknown, a uh, Pharaoh Letter again. Alright, finally we get a shifter. Alright, sweet, the party can start here. Yes, we use Giant Fan here. Heads, alright, we'll pick up a uh, Halucha. Here we'll Devolution Spray, the shifter. Put it back down. Use a giant fan, heads, and there we go. Turn one, we get the victory. Uh, my opponent didn't even have a turn one. We giant fan two Pokemon back into the deck. And uh, yeah, you can see why this deck's so strong. We'll play another game with this deck, and hopefully it's as exciting as that was this time. And uh, maybe I'll try to get one of my friends to build a deck with 60 Pokemon, and that way they can have six Pokemon out in the field, and uh, maybe we can try to shuffle in six Pokemon on it. But there you go. Game one, we won before my opponent even had a turn, which is great. So here we'll see another game here in a second. <laughs> All right, so here we're playing against Felipe, playing the Dragon Steel Colorless deck. I'm going to call heads like always. And nice. Finnick is on our side here. So our turn. Oh my goodness. We get C dot and three unknowns and a level ball. What? What kind of start is this? This is amazing. We tied like a force of giant plants. Oh man, we, we're good to go here. We'll put down three unknowns and a Jirachi start. We'll put down a C dot. Level ball for another unknown. And let's start playing these bad boys. Here we'll use Pharaoh Letter 1. Uh, let's play Shaman. Draw, we have four cards. We can Acrobike. Guess we'll keep the Devolution Spray. Here we'll play Unknown uh, farewell, farewell Letter. We can play another Farewell Letter. And nice, we got the Force of Giant Plant. We got that a Nuzleaf. We got that a Nuzleaf. We can Ultra Ball, discard the Level Ball and Float Stone. Here we get a Shiftry. Let's put down the shiftery and if giant fan let's see what we get here and has shuffling that draw chin and winning another game with uh with shiftery and uh yeah you can see why this deck just beats you know pokemon, people who only have one pokemon two pokemon out but the question is can you beat somebody who has six pokemon out on turn one and that's what we're going to test here i got a friend who wants to uh try this out and we're going to see if we can do this here and also another thing you will have to worry about is wobbuffet if your opponent plays a wobbuffet it can shut down your abilities, making it where you can't use Shiftry or something with um 
with like Mega Sceptile, which makes it where you're you're not affected by abilities. And a ball toy also has this. So if your opponent plays a single ball toy, they can actually just win win the game against Shifter because they can never get you know you can never shuffle in that ball toy. But the question is, can they even get a turn to get the ball toy out before you can start giant fanning? I don't know. That's the big mystery here. But here we'll see another game with Shiftery. We'll play against a, po a person with six Pokemon out in the field. So let's see that here in a second. All right. So here we're playing against Keanu Cole, better known as John Collier, who is one of the guys who actually helped start Team Fish Knuckles, and he does get to go first here. But it shouldn't matter if John is playing correctly. He should have sixty Pokemon, and oh, the start it hurts. Shame at start. We play four C dot for unknown, and we start with the one of the three Shaman. That's not good for us here. Um, we get an Acrobike. We can recycle. All right, so he chooses for us to go first. Here, we're Acrobike. We'll get an Ultra Ball, and here, Ultra Ball, discard a recycle. Uh, I'm trying to see here. What's the better play? Yeah, I think it's still better to discard the bicycle and recycle. And here we can grab a C dot, putting it down, put down the Nuzleaf Shaman. I mean, <laughs> bike for three. Put down the Shaman. Draw. Do you have six cards? Um, we can super scoop up tails. Super scoop up heads. We can pick up a Shaman. Send in the Nuzleaf. Put down a Floatstone. We can recycle, try to get back a super scoop up. And so put a super scoop up back onto the top of the deck. And uh, we'll play Shaman here. Draw on TF6 cards. Do we get a shift tree? And we don't right now. We'll put down another C dot. We'll play a Nuzleaf. We'll play an Acrobike. Um, we'll grab the Devolution Spray. Here we'll play. Um, let's re. I'm trying to debate which one is better right now. I guess we'll shame in here. Draw all DF6 cards. Wow, this hand is really confusing. Alright, so Battle Compressor. And here we'll discard cards we don't need, which is Force of Giants Plant. No, not Level Ball. Force of Giants Plant. Force of Giants Plant. And another third one if it's in there. It's not. So here we'll Acrobike looking for a Shift Tree. And we get a Scoop Up Cyclone. Uh, here. Well, Trainer's Mill? Hmm, I'm trying to decide which is the best way here. Oh, well, Trainer's Mill. Grab a Lover Ball. Put the Lover Ball down. Here we'll get an Unknown. Put that bad boy down. Here we will Super Scoop Up, trying to pick up a Shaman. Alright, so we'll pick up a Shaman. Put it back down. Draw all DF6 cards. Do we get a Shift Tree? We finally get a Shift Tree. We'll play the first one. Heads, let's put the Gallade in there. Devolution Spray, Shiftry. Put it back down. Yes. Alright, so number two is good to go. Well, Trainer's Mel here. Grab another Devolution Spray. Can we be six for six on these uh, giant fans? Number three. Tails. Trainer's Mel. Devolution Spray. Play it. Pick up Shiftry. Put it back down. Use Giants fan. Heads. Alright, so we're three for one. We'll recycle. Put back a Devolution Spray. Nice. We get heads there. And uh, here we'll scoop up Cyclone. Pick up a Shaman. Wait, hold on. Let's think here. Yeah, scoop up Cyclone and a Shaman. Putting it back down. Draw. Do you have six cards in our hand? Here we get a Shaman. Or a Shift Tree. Use it. Tails. Devolution Spray. A Shift Tree. Putting it back down. Yep, we'll use it again. Heads. Alright, pick up the Aegis Slash. We will Ultra Ball these two away for an unknown. Here, we'll use it. We did this unknown Pharaoh Letter. We get a Super Scoop Up. Heads. Pick up Shift Tree. And send up the other Shift Tree. Here, we'll put C Dots, Nuzleaf, Unknown, Shift Tree. Give me heads. Oh, uh, Tails. Bike for four. Um, let's see here. Farewell letter. Unknown. Farewell letter. 
Ultra discard these two. What's left in our deck? We got a Nuzleaf. Oh, I forgot to check here. Well, Juniper. Oh, uh, we don't have enough to actually giant fan for the game. We'll recycle. Tells. And uh, that's the party there. Uh, okay. Uh, we got four out of the six. You see why this deck is kind of hard to get uh, six Pokemon shuffled away. But we got four out of the six. Usually decks only play like two or three Pokemon at the start. So if you can hit this many heads, you can see why this deck is strong. But if they do have six Pokemon turn one, it's going to be hard to beat them. I've been trying this for a couple, couple of hours and I can't get it. But hopefully you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. You can see why Shifter is so strong. And uh, what are your thoughts on Shifter? Do you think it's broke as everybody thinks it is? Uh, I think it is. I mean, we shuffled in three out of the six Pokemon. No, four out of the six Pokemon to play. So that's very nice there. But hopefully you enjoyed. I hope you have a great day. Alrighty, bye.